Welcome back to Suncoast View. We're going to check back in with Chef Rocky from Yo Sushi. And Chef, tell us a little bit about the Yo Sushi concept. I know there's a lot of bowls involved. <laughs> well, it's uh, it's actually a kaiten sushi concept. It's uh, it's literally rotation sushi in Japanese. Um, it's a variety of colorful plates on a belt. It's all arranged by price, by color. Okay. So there's seven different bowls, seven different prices. Um, it's a pretty popular concept. It's taken off by storm. So you can stop in the mall and try different things and decide how much you want. Absolutely. All right, yep. sounds great. And we're going to have sumo style. We want it all. <laughs> we're coming over in a little bit. <laughs> Thanks, Chef. Now, as you're making your list and you're checking it twice, don't forget about your four-legged and furry friends, our pets are part of our families and they like to get presents too so our pet trendologist and iHeartRadio host Charlotte Reed is here with some great ideas so let's get into it mm -hmm. well happy holidays everyone everyone looks great I Thank love you. when we celebrate with hats <laughs> I know she I know. always brings I us hats right these are the ch these are the cheaper versions we can't wait till May for the big time Kentucky Derby versions but <laughs> you all look great and thank you very much Thank for looking you. so mm. festive okay so let's talk about the ugly holiday sweater. It's going to be passe <laughs> for pets. So what you want to do now is have the costumes. So mm, Ty okay. is dressed as a holiday elf, right with the little hat <laughs> and the little mitts on his paws oh there. So he looks really, really Ty cute. Ty is very patient. Sarah. He really is. I mean, I have to tell you, I actually did an inventory of my costume collection. Don't laugh, I have 300 pet costumes. What? And I'm still buying more. But this is from Ruby's, and they're actually very nice to us. They sponsor us through the course of the year. So we love wearing Ty dressed up. It is really it cute. Is. Right. It really I is. mean, it, it looks fun. And so. he really looks excited. <laughs> <laughs> but sometimes dogs do like having something around their midsection. It does calm do. them down. And it's easy to pull off and put yeah. on. But you know what it is, really? Once the dogs like wearing the costumes and they get tons of attention. Now, I, Hannah, you all know, my golden retriever, she doesn't like costumes. Okay, next up, I brought you some stocking stuffers. Because those are the ultimate pet giving mm -hmm. okay. systems. So dig so, in our stockings. Dig, right in. dig in our stocks. Right? So you all have, Ooh, yummy. Oh. Marcia has sweet potato, Joey has dental treats, you have chicken <laughs> and, I have and you ears. have pig's ears. And these are for loving pets products. And what's great about them, these are their mini versions. You can find all of these for a dollar in the dollar store. Oh, really? And they're all healthy. The best, the trend right now is made in the USA with USA ingredients, sourced from New Jersey. Mm. And as you can see, they put made in the USA. Made in the USA. Ty, Ty, Ty knows, knows, Ty knows what they are. Ty knows. So <laughs> these are great gifts because if oh, you want to try a new treat, and treats are one of the most bought items for pet yes. owners, you can try something all natural without breaking the bank. Oh, nice. I love a lot of attention going yeah. on. Yeah. A lot of attention. Ty's right. excited. Okay, so let's talk about bigger gifts. Mm -hmm. Okay. so. You know, Miranda Lambert right now, she's so hot with her new album, the new country album, mm -hmm. but she's also in, you know, the news for Blake Sheldon, the divorce, right. mm -hmm. and Gwen Stefani. Well, one of the things we love about Miranda is that she teamed up with Petmate Pet Products okay. to do a whole Mutt Nation rescue line. So it's cause pet related marketing oh. at its oh. best. Oh. So we've got this, I love this right here. This little this guitar is here. The guitar chew toy which is awesome which is just really really nice yes. and you can Funny. stuff all these treats right at Lipsy Ty so Ty, interesting. Ty is ready no, to in. dig in. And there's leashes, collars, coats, toys oh, nice. and even beds like this lamb so um, lambskin oh, bed, which nice. I really yeah, like Nashville. it. And they're right. <laughs> oh, she can rock. Typical Miranda Lambert. Yeah. Fun. And this is only for small dogs. Okay. This bed, obviously. But you know, these are great. And I'm going to actually give this to you because you have Riley. Yeah. And that. See how soft it is to chew on that. Our it's guide not, dog puppy will like this. Right. And it is soft. And it is He's soft. It's right not going to hurt even an older dog's right. teeth. No, and that's really important. important. A lot like of the this. dogs are too Now, if you're difficult. giving the dog a lot of treats, though, we got to keep our dog um, healthy and yes. exercised. And so you have something else. That's a really else. good point because American dogs are just as fat as their American owners. Oh. So I love this Fit Paws gym down below. And you can this is called Gym in a Box. Okay. So you have the climb, which Ty learned to climb on last night. Oh, fun. So think oh. of it like a Pilates kit in a box. You have the fit bone, which the dogs can like literally balance on and work their core. Oh, my God. Isn't that cute? That's awesome. And then you have the big ball, which you blow up. The Bosu ball. And then you also <laughs> have the paws. Now, the company who makes this makes the same conditioning equipment for humans. Oh, the only difference, people were buying so much of that 
company Stuff Ball Dynamics, they decided to make it tougher because dogs were ruining the products because mm, of the right, nails going right, through. Right. So wow. you have also paw pads, which your dogs can actually put their paws on and strengthen their legs and their core. So that's also oh, fun. I nice. like that idea. Okay, going to a party and don't want to bring the typical bottle of wine or candles. I can't even tell you how many people have told me on my Naughty and Nice tour that they've gotten candles. Because mm -hmm. it's cheap, it's that. easy. You know, even some of my friends at the Met said they got some candles for Free people gift. who work there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> ornaments. Instead of buying a bottle of wine or a candle, buy your host a nice ornament. Now, these are from Bronner's, which I love, and they run from anywhere from like $8.99 to $14.99. Uh -huh. So if they have a rescue dog or your host just died, for example, my dog Hudson died, so we got a remembrance yeah, ornament. These are really or you, yeah. And they've got cats. I mean, what a great gift. Them. And the nice thing is when you walk in the door, like if I went to your house and bought you the Chihuahua ornament or the Schnauzer ornament, the host is so excited. She runs over and puts it right, right. on the Christmas oh, tree. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. These are great. Thank you, Charlotte. You can so find more of Charlotte's great ideas by going to charlottereed.com. And next, we're going to get away for a little bit. We're going to see some ideas for Florida holiday getaways.